All right, hey, Josh here, Attica Lumber Company, out here in Sadusky County, Ohio. But check this out, early stages of this 24 by 38 post frame building. Gonna be a fairly simple build here. Just to kind of give you an overview, a backdrop. You can see what the guys are doing there. They're knocking out the uh, sidewall girts here, the two by six sidewall girts. And these are gonna be 30 inches apart but you can see what's going on here. Let's see if we can, well, you can see James over here, he's marking out that six by six for the sidewall girth. See what he's doing here. We'll watch these guys, see how they do that. They go from the bottom of the baseboard right there. Boom, and then mark that right there on that six by six. And then they're gonna attack that two by six SPF. So obviously it's helpful to have a, a team this is a crew of four. This shouldn't take too long. This is day two. So this should be actually most likely three days. The steel's here. Again, a 24 by 38. So it's always helpful to have, you know, more than one guy. But if you're doing it by one guy, I've seen it done before. Not recommendable, but it can be done. And uh, you can see what they're doing there as far as measuring. But what we did on this, six by six, and let me take a look. Yeah, six by six, actually corner post. You can see that six by six corner post. And again, we go down here, 54 inches. We put it on a 12 inch cookie, concrete cookie. And then what we do, we put uplifts. We run it east and west, north and south. So we run uplifts two by six. That way this, that anchors it right into the ground. And then that stone right there, that's a 411 perm, berm mix. We don't backfill it with stone. We backfill it with that berm mix. See that? So it's kind of like a highway stone. Very sandy. And you can see the water can dissipate. So you can see right there a 2 by 10 a two by ten baseboard. Again, that's ground contact. That's a number one treated board. Again, we want to keep away from termite rot and then the elements of the rain as well. So a ground contact number one treated. So you can see the steps, the sequence of what they're doing to get this laid out and then they're gonna rock and roll with the metal and then knock this out. So let's go back to these guys right here, what they're doing here. See, it helps to have the tools, no doubt about it. Have the tools and then they can knock this out. So teamwork definitely. So um, that kind of gives you an idea right there. Again, trusses, four foot on center, two by four, bottom cord, and also two by four top cord. And we talked about the fasteners as far as, but I'll repeat that again. If you look at that, if you look at the double top beam header right there, that's an RRS screw right up there. See that? Hopefully you can see that. Yeah, see that? So that gives you an idea there. So early stages here, but we'll keep you up to the breast on this when this is finished up so you can see the completed project, what it looks like. But for more information, definitely visit atticlumber.com and appreciate you watching the video. And uh, until the next one, keep it locked and loaded right here, atticlumber.com.